Oh, 4.5x. <laughs> one shot, one kill. Sniped. <laughs> Night Stalker strikes again. Now we're standing at the end of the world, my friend, and there's nothing we can do about it now. Yeah, we're standing at the end of the world, my friend. Gonna watch it all burn down. Yeah, we're gonna watch it all burn down. Uh, do you ever get the feeling you're being watched? Hmm. Oh, hey! Stop it! Whoa! She's still there! <laughs> there she goes. Uh, anything up there? Oh, yeah, look at that ammo pile. I almost destroyed it. Ooh, look at that. All that time, right there, hidden behind that picture of the strange lady. Anyway, welcome back to Seven Days to Die. We're back at the cozy cabin. And I'm just getting organized here. Just cooked up some bacon and eggs now that I am a chef. I uh, upgraded to bachelor. Um, if I'm gonna be a bachelor, you might as well play the part, right? And now, my friends, we're gonna head over to uh, Trader Bob's and make that bicycle that we were trying to make in the last episode, but we were unable to do so. We ran out of time, but we're gonna go do it right now. Let me just drop a few things here. We'll come back and do some more cooking. I was testing to see which food was better. Bacon and eggs is the way to roll. But for right now, we're just going to cook, uh, eat up this grilled meat. And the boiled meat. And let's get some of this stuff moved around. There we go. Now we're not encumbered. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's go. I think we're ready. Oh, hold on. Let me turn up that fire. And go blow it out. <gasps> there we go. Perfect. All right. It's out. <laughs> we'll come back and do some more cooking later. Right now we have a priority, and that is to make the bicycle. I'm pretty sure we have all the parts now. Just gotta get over to the trader before they close. I think the dude closes at, is it uh, 10? It's either eight or 10. So we, we should have plenty of time. And then we're gonna make our bike. And then we're gonna go back to the, uh, oh, hold on, we got somebody here. We got somebody here across the street. Let's take him out. And we have to go back to the, um, the trailer park. I actually, had uh i looted the entire trailer park there we go backstab oh he's not dead get down stay down right in the buttocks second shot did him in yeah so i completed the oh left the door open yeah i was here earlier selling so as you can see it is still day five but late in the Anything afternoon you like uh yeah let's see what you got I want to buy before we lose it. This batter up, batter up volume one. Do 10% more damage with clubs. And I'm assuming that Thanks means baseball bats. Here. You betcha. Here. You betcha. Thanks, Bob. Now we're going to go use your uh, your workbench. Okay. So, yeah. So I cleared out the whole trailer park. And I killed a wolf and a bear. Killed them both. Got lots of meat back there and a bunch of other things. We need to go back and get. And we'll do that with the bicycle. But let's get this bicycle rolling in more ways than one but first we gotta spend some points on where's my grease monkey there it is bicycle mechanic and as i had mentioned i did also put points into master chef so we can cook uh cook some bacon and eggs every bachelor needs bacon and eggs all right let's make the bike chassis right here take 30 seconds for that we got everything we need let's throw in the wheels we need two of those right Two wheels. Two minutes for the wheels. Holy cow. Um, well, let's do those last. What's the other thing? We need handlebars. Bicycle handlebars. 30 seconds for the handlebars. 30 seconds for the chassis. But the wheels take two minutes a piece. Uh, one minute a piece. And we have just enough of everything. All that tracking down the acid really paid off. And now we wait. Um, what should we do? Oh, we need bow parts too. Oh, we're so close to the bow parts. Yeah, I think we need these to make... Well, there's always Shamway uh, up the road. Yeah, you can try yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, I want to make a bow. I think we make the wooden bow here. Oh, handlebars and the uh, chassis are done. Yeah, so there's a wooden bow that we learned how to make. Not a wooden bow, but just a wooden bow. Yeah, this guy right here. We need six crossbow and bow parts. Drat. So he has, what, four for sale? For 300 well we should buy them we should go out and get some more cash today and then or at least sell some stuff 
get some more cash, and then um, we can make that wooden bow. It's going to be better than what we're using. Oh, man, we're so close to leveling up. Let's go Let's go do stuff. we got one minute to wait for the wheel. That last wheel, we might as well go out. Earn our keep. We can earn some experience by killing. Got a woman right here walking down the street. Going somewhere. Going to visit a friend. Neighbor. Didn't expect to get shot today, did you? Probably not. Sorry. Need the experience. <laughs> We can bang on a rock and get some rocks, and that'll give us experience. Oh, that, nope, can't do that. That's Bob's stone. Bob doesn't like it when he when he touches stones, even the big one. All right, Are we done? Oh, we done. Two wheels, uh, handlebars, and the chassis, and now we can whip up the bicycle. I did close the door, right? I think so. Let's go check. Thirty seconds to make the whole bike. <laughs> did I close the door? Yeah, I close the door. I hear somebody knocking around out there. Yeah, we're so close to leveling up, and then we can um, spend another point on something. And there we go. One second. We got our bike. Woohoo! It's a yellow beauty. Look at that. Haha. <laughs> Let's go try it out. Now we got some wheels. Oop, hold on. There's somebody out here. Hey. Store's closed. Will be anyway, soon. <laughs> oh. I think I shot Bob's place. Back off. Back off, man. <laughs> Headshot. Here we go. Level 8. Alright, now let's put the bike out. Oh, can't put it out here. This is Bob's place. We gotta go over here. Yeah, there we go. Perfect. Guys, look at this. There we go. We're on. <laughs> Looks so ridiculous on this bike. But, it's awesome. It's so much faster than walking. And it doesn't use any stamina when you're riding normal speed. If you hold down shift and you sprint, then you're pedaling hard and you use a little bit of stamina. Oh, well, I'm peeling out. Nice. That'll make me sick. Uh, let's check this garage while we're here. Didn't mean to come here, but might as well. Because garages sometimes have the good stuff, right? Uh, mechanical parts and that kind of thing. We could definitely use... Wow! And people! Sometimes. Oh my gosh, that dude came out of nowhere! He's <laughs> hiding in there! You little stinker! You little stinker! Back off, kid! Jeez! Now! Man, it's so quiet sometimes. I mean, I did go in kind of recklessly. Usually you can hear him, like... breathing. All right, I don't know why we're here. It really doesn't matter. We could just go home. It's getting kind of late. Um, but well, while we're here, let's check the uh, check for some nice clothes. Ooh, hold on, those look good. Sewing kit's great. Cans, we'll take them. Let's check those pants. Gothic pants. Ooh, they're better than what I'm wearing. I gotta get rid of my kilt. That's a shame. Yeah, well, we're taking the kilt off, and we're going to grab that pocket mod out. <laughs> How do we get that out of there? Come on out of there. So let's modify our gothic pants. Beautiful. Put them on. Yeah, much better to look than the kilt, don't you think? <laughs> All right, anyway. Uh, ooh, well, hold on. We can, get, we can get good stuff from these weights. Oh, I hear somebody outside. Um, they're not going to chew up my bike, are they? I don't think so. I think it's just one dude outside anyway. I tell you what I don't like is all these cabinets. Yeah, these right here. Oh! Oh, boy! I did it! Now I did it! Ooh! Want a hug? A quick hugger. She is a quick hugger. Yeah, I know there's stuff behind all these pictures, as, as we had noticed back at home. So let's have a look, quick look. Bone knife. Eh, I don't really need a bone knife. I'm going to grab it so that something else might spawn in there later. Not that I think we're ever coming back here again. Ooh, water? Oh, a nice water bottle. So I thought we could get... What do we get from this? Oh, it's just scrap. I thought we got uh, forged metal from those, but I guess not. All right, let's, uh, oh, wow, look at that. 
AK-47 schematic. That's amazing. And slumber party. It's best to come late to the party. Do an extra 50% sneak damage to sleeping victims at night. Oh, oh we're going to be Night Stalker. Oh, baby. We're going to be Night Stalker. Let's scrap that. My kilt. I think we're done with the kilt. <laughs> oh, boy. Somebody, somebody's out here. I'm encumbered as well. We, we need to go. Um, let's get on our bike and let's boogie. Oh, we got this guy. Oh, he fell down. <laughs> what the heck? He opened the door and then he fell. That's great. And here he comes. Oh. I missed. Let him in. Hey! Oh, man. I missed. I missed. I said don't miss. And what I had to do, I missed. All right, we're fine. We're going to go back home now and get healed up. I'm going to cook up some nice meals. And we have one point to spend on something. I'm not sure exactly what yet, but we'll figure it out. Oh, I'm going to run over this chicken. Spy chicken in the road. Can we get him? Oh, <laughs> All right, now now he knows we're after him. Now he knows. He's on to us. Oh, he <laughs> right between the wheels. Where'd he go? Oh, he's back in the road. It's gonna be an official road kill. Oh, all right, this guy's toying with me. I'm done. Oh. Oh. Trader Joe's. Trader Joe's just closed. Oh, they close at 20, 2130. Wow. Wait, God, that dude stays open late. Oh, man. Someone's banging on the back door. Hey. Oh. <laughs> Look who it is. It's Bubba. Bubba's back for the sugar. Man, you was tough. Oh. Oh. Oh, he almost got me. Almost got me. Trader Joe's is now closed. Oh, that, that's the closing message. What did he say before that he was getting ready to close? I guess he was giving the shoppers a two-minute warning. <laughs> yeah, maybe we'll go out tonight and do some hunting since we have that special stealth ability now. Let me just get organized and then uh, we'll head out. Maybe do some night hunting. Seems like fun. Okay, it's just past midnight, which means we have about, I think, four hours. Uh, well, more like four minutes. <laughs> to go do some night stalking because I'm pretty sure the sun comes up at 4 a.m. Let's put our, our point into uh, something stealthy, like from the shadows. Hide in the shadows, 13% more effectively. Noises from actions are muffled 10%. Sneak movement is 10% faster. Well, that's kind of nice. Yeah, that, that should go well with our night stalking ability here. Do an extra 50% sneak damage to sleeping victims at night. So we have to hunt at night. I'm not fond of going out at night. We don't really do much of that. When we play Seven Days to Die, but I think it'll be uh, interesting. <laughs> Let's eat some bacon and eggs and get a stamina bonus and get that health back up. And we'll drink some Wawa. There we go. All right. Now, I'm not bringing the bike because that makes no sense. You don't ride bikes at night. It's dangerous. I might get run over. So we're gonna we're gonna walk stealthily and try to shoot some sleepers. Although I don't think Zambies sleep. Ooh outside do they <laughs> i don't think so so where should we go yeah there might be some sleepers in the church man it is super dark sorry about that we do have a flashlight though except that it makes us really visible <laughs> see when we're down without the light on we're at five eye turn on the light we're at 40 eye so i think we want to keep that eye as low as possible right and we're going to have to make a little noise here to get in. Um, this is another way in. Maybe there's another way in. It might be a sneaky way in. Yeah, this is very new for us. We don't usually do nighttime hunting. But I like it. I want to be a night stalker. Wait, here's somebody. Hello? What was that? I think it's somebody in the church. Might have heard us walking by. I know it's super dark for you guys. I'm going to brighten it up in the in the editor so you can see a little bit better. Although, frankly, I, I can't see much. It's really, really dark for me. <laughs> um, yeah, this doesn't look any better. 
maybe there is no other way in the church other than the front door or the back door. Let's just go to the front. And we'll knock out a panel. Let's take the top panel out first and have a peek. Oh, that's loud. Oh, I think I see somebody, but it's really hard for me to see. Is that a, is that a zombie right there? Oh, 4.5x. <laughs> one shot, one kill. Sniped. <laughs> Night Stalker. That's what they call me. It's really dark. All right, I'm going to just use the flashlight. I'm going to do a quick boop, doop, and off. Doop, doop. All right, well, let's break in all the way. I have a feeling there's going to be more zombies in here, maybe in the corner somewhere. <laughs> Nothing sneaking up behind. And the Night Stalker enters the church looking for prey. <laughs> oh, what's that? We got one. <laughs> oh, what the? Really? Stay down. Nice and quiet. That's how we do it. That's how the Night Stalker does it. See, that was not a headshot, so it didn't kill outright. Plus, this bow stinks. We've got to get a new ball. Hopefully, we can get back to Bob's in the morning and uh, buy those parts. Hopefully, he doesn't change his uh, his stock, because I think he does that every couple of days, right? Oh, wait, does that make noise? Going through a bird's nest? I think it does. All right, we're going to do pew by pew. Is that asleep? Oh, oh no, no. Oh gosh. I misfired. Oh, that's the head. Okay. <laughs> Dead. Night Stalker strikes again. You know, this is kind of the, the reverse of I Am Legend, right? I know I talk about this a lot, but the the uh, the book I Am Legend, um, and also the very first movie with Vincent Price, um, is about a guy that goes around during the day and stalks the, uh, the, they're not really zombies, they're more like vampires. They sleep during the day indoors and he tracks them all down and kills them. He has to put a stake through their heart to kill them because they're kind of like vampires, more vampire-y than zombies. And he does that during the day while they're vulnerable. And I feel like that's exactly what we're doing right here, except it's the opposite. We're doing it at night. It's crazy. But it certainly is interesting. And dramatic. The light over there. Maybe something in that light. All right, I think we got everybody. All right, let's go over here. I'm gonna turn the flashlight on real quick. Oh, speaking of vampires and coffins, I bet there's something in that coffin right there. <laughs> We're gonna go check that out. But first, let me just sniff around with the light on over here. There's some rubbish. Oh, oh, we already have that because it's an open book. Attracting stock mod. Yeah, we already have that, don't we? That's why it shows the open book right there. I mean, aren't there like dozens and dozens of schematics and we get the same one? We only have like three schematics so far. What terrible luck is that? Let's go up here and check the coffin. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, oh, get down. Why are, you, why are you popping up? What is that? Is that a little man? I can't see. Oh, well, that's a little man. <laughs> It's really dark for me. I can just barely make out like a, a collar. <laughs> Got another one. Stalking. Yes, this is a coffin. I don't think there's going to be a zombie inside of it. And we got this awesome chest right here. All right, well, let's, oh, there's another one over there, too. All right, let's check this coffin right here. Some bullets. It's nice. And then this chest. Empty. What a ripoff. That is a ripoff. And this one. Empty. Two empty chests. Oh. Shh. Get out of the light. Get in the dark. Oh man, there's something out there sniffing around. They don't call us a night stalker for nothing. We are the super predator now. <laughs> Let's go track this thing down. Oh, it's actually starting to get a little brighter out, isn't it? Yeah, the sun's going to be up at 4 o'clock. That's when uh, nighttime ends. And we'll lose our bonus. Oh, 
There's a, there's a wolf or a dog or right something right there. Heading to our cozy cottage. Ooh, battery. I think battery's pretty good, isn't it? Um, yeah. I don't think we want to mess with that thing. They are tough. Super tough. Yeah, like I said earlier, I killed one at the um, at the trailer park. And there was also a bear, but I, I used kind of the door cheat. Whacking him through the door. So I got a ton of meat back at the trailer park we need to go fetch. Oh man, he's just patrolling right in front of the house. I don't like that. Oh, it's now morning. Hey, night time is over. We do not have our night stalker bonus damage any longer against sleepers. Wouldn't help us with that guy anyway. The the wolf. Or Merle. Because <laughs> Merle's not sleeping. Hey, Merle. Ooh, he's coming. What's up, buddy? Wow, you're up early this morning. Go for a morning walk? Hmm? Couldn't sleep last night? Merle's got insomnia, I think. Poor fella. All right, well, the ultimate predator is heading inside now. I'm going to just go in the back door. Try to avoid that wolfie. We do have a back door over here, don't we? Oh, man, look at all the wood back here. We got a huge wood pile. It's actually really, really nice. Wood is good. Oh, you know what else we can do? We can make cigars now. I got two um, testosterone vials from the bear, but we need... We need uh, we need a lot of fiber. Let's let's punch a bunch of fiber. Let's do that right now. I don't need to use the axe. I don't want to waste it. I think we need like 200 fiber or something like that. It's crazy. 150. Where where can we get a lot of fiber quickly? Maybe from hay? I don't know. If you know the answer, let me know down in the comments because this is gonna take forever. But I think the cigars give you like crazy buffs. I don't know how long it lasts, but we'll probably make at least one and then save it. Save it for a major raid, or maybe we'll save it for the seventh day. Seventh day horde, which I believe we're going to get on the tenth day. I think I changed it to day ten. So we got a few more days to prepare for that. I'm going to grab some chrysanthemums. Now that I'm a bachelor and I have that cooking skill, I can make teas, I think. Yes, we can use it to brew tea and craft other items. I like a tea. All right, let's head back inside. Go slow. That wolf is still around here somewhere. All right, here's the back door. Oh, no. Oh, it's locked. Oh, gosh. It's breaking into the house. Uh-oh. He must have heard us, but he went... He's going through the front to get to us. Back door's locked. Oh, boy. All right, we gotta run. We gotta run. <laughs> That wolf knows we're around somewhere. I think he sniffed us out. I think the wolf is actually the ultimate predator. <laughs> I talk a good game, but I think the wolf wins that award. Is there any high ground we can get? Maybe up on this wall. Um, let's try that. Let's get up on top of this wall. Maybe we can snipe him from here. This would actually be a pretty good base with this outer wall. You know? Oh, hold on. We got a sleeper here. Now, we're not going to get our extra night stalking damage, but we'll still get the sneak damage if I can hit it. There we go. Yeah, 4.0. Still a one-shot kill if you get the headshot. Oh, Trader Joe's. Oh, we got to go. We got to go to Trader Joe's. Got to go to Trader Joe's. This is where we should have done the hunting, right here. Everybody's sleeping in the graveyard, of course. <laughs> Makes total sense. All right, nice and slow now. We don't want things popping out of the ground if they hear us. Really? Candlestick? All right, let's go to Trader... Oh, there's a coffin down here. Nice. Bullets. All right, well, the bullets are good. Okay, I don't want to do this POI right now. Except for this coffin right here. Wow. Everybody gets buried with bullets around here. <laughs> okay. Whew. So safe in here. I feel so safe. Hey, Bob. Thank God, a customer. I thought you might be one of the dead. Nope. Perfectly living. Probably the only customer you get, eh? All right. Let's see if we can find... Oh, there's night vision goggles right here. 
That's perfect for Night Stalker. Oh my gosh. 4,000. Oh, I cannot afford that. But we're going to sell that and show me those parts, baby. Right here. 300. All right. I'm going to buy these parts. Oh, where's my money? Yeah, I don't have my money. Now. Of course I don't have my money. It's at home. Oh, dang it. I should carry my money on me. I should put it in my sock or something. All right. We're going to go home and get the cash. Although that dang wolf is over there. Sometimes I keep my cash in this chest right here, but I don't think I, I did. Uh, no, it ain't there. All right. I guess I'm going to go home and see if I can get the rest of my cash. I do want to get those parts before he changes his inventory. Did he eat his way out? I don't hear him. They're super stealthy. Hello? Wolfie? I don't see the wolf. Oh, did he do this? Yeah, he did. You crazy wolf. All right, well, I'm gonna put the bars right here. Cause that could actually be very useful for fighting. Looks like the wolf is gone. Let's check this room. We gotta clear the house now. Where is that wolf? Go upstairs, did he? Oh, there's a, there's a little hidden panel. Maybe he just went out the window. Well, I don't know. I don't see him. Guess he's gone. Let's see what's down here. Ooh, medical pile. This wolf is tricksy. Uh. Oh. <laughs> oh, wait, we haven't even checked this room yet? Bullets. And this iron desk. Oh, wow. What are those boots? Gothic boots. Ooh. Well, we have really nice shoes, so I'm just going to sell these. Wow, they're worth 50 apiece. All right. All right. Okay, I'm going to head back and do some shopping. I don't see that wolf. It's a mystery. And frankly, I don't care. I'm going to take my bike, go for a ride, <laughs> and sell some stuff to our friend. Bob and make some money and I think I'm going to cook up some meat real quick here All right, well, that's two minutes to burn. So let's go a boil. I guess we should say let's go um, Let's go get those gold parts I have a feeling that wolf is gonna be right out here somewhere. So I'm gonna put the bike down I bet we can outrun him on a bike you think <laughs> I don't know <laughs> But I have a feeling we would run out of stamina before the wolf did. <laughs> er, all right. We're back. Want to buy those parts? Got some stuff to sell you. I got just the thing for what's ailing you. Uh, sell those. Sell the cowboy boots. Sell this. Up to 600 bucks. And I need those boat parts, bro. It's only four, though. We need two more. Although now I'm thinking maybe I should save up for the crossbow schematic. Yeah, I you know what? You can, sir. Um, I'm going to think about it, Bob. Let me know down in the comments what we should do. Hang on to the money, maybe buy that crossbow schematic. We just got those parts now, since they're, they are available. I think we can go do this quest and make some money. Why don't we do that in the next episode, and I will uh, check out all your comments, and we'll come up with a plan for next time. And I think for right now, I'm going to head back home and get organized. And I'll be ready for the next episode with you guys. All right. Turn that off. Grab the boiled meat. And let's eat. Mm -mm -mm. Have a sip of water. And I think with that, my friends, we're going to call it quits. And I'll see you all in the next episode. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. And have a good day. Bye-bye.